maybe maybe there's a fastener let's let's just check this I don't think so oh yeah look at that maybe there is one uh, this is a rubber seal let's choose a smaller screwdriver maybe we can get underneath yeah this would be really funny yeah look at that wow a secret little rubber seal see that pops into that that's the key and it's a very small uh, Phillips let's see my bigger Phillips will fit into that well, obviously not so I should choose a a smaller Phillips which I have beautiful you have to push it on so that you don't damage the head and then turn this it's a it's a screw it goes into plastic I can feel that it's difficult to take it off you have to really push it on it still doesn't want to fall out all right okay I got it so here we go wow long way you see that the plastic is on the end it shows really that it is plastic now we should be able to take this off easily well he says so it's still pretty tight so hmm this is tricky you see you should do this because you can scratch the plastic you know from a design point of view there should be some help now if you do it at the end you can you can damage the connector so st I'm still not happy with this I still can't take this off all right so how can you take this off if you try it on the edge you might damage the, the cover so maybe there's another secret involved somewhere See, we already damaged that there. The only way you can get to this is to force it on the side to open this up. Now by doing so, I managed to damage the side because the designers didn't think of this process. 